plank. Now this is for core stability. Front, back, shoulders. I'm going to show you two ways of doing the plank. My name is Dr. Laura Gravel, Campbell Care Chiropractic, chiropractor in London, Ontario. We need that stability. That helps with posture. That helps keep us upright. Keeps everything tight in the midsection. So core strength stabilizes that low back so we don't get that sagging and weakness. First one, we're going to be up. Legs are behind you. We squeezing in the glutes. You can look about six inches in front of you as tight as a board that you can. If you start with 10 seconds, that's great. If you can work yourself up to a minute. This helps core strength, low back stability. Next variety I'm going to show you is a forearm plank. We're going to be down, forearms, legs, feet, shoulder width apart, tight in that core. <clears throat> I say if somebody came up, and did this to you, they would bounce off. You're tight, taut in the middle, just like a, a, a tight band. So arms down, legs wide, looking six to eight inches ahead of you, squeezing in the glutes. You may so find one side fires more than the other. Squeezing 10 to 15 seconds, if you can work up to a minute, that's fabulous. The benefit of a plank, core stability, reduces that low back vulnerability and we need a strong and stable low back specifically for all of the people that sit all day we that low back simply isn't supported as it should be and then we do life on that hope that